So here we have the Ford Fiesta EcoBoost ST line on a 67 plate. I'm going to start off by showing you around the outside of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. But from the outside you can see it's a three door car with those lovely black alloy wheels. Let's start off inside the boot and then work around the rest of the car from there. So as we approach the back of the car you will see we have reversing sensors, plenty of boot space as well along with that 60-40 split folding rear seat. Okay, so we're just going to work our way back round to the front of the car now and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. But now that we've done a full circle of it, you can see it's in lovely condition the whole way round. Just briefly before I climb in, I think it's well worth seeing the interior from this exterior point of view. These seats are in fantastic condition. There's plenty to run through on the dashboard, so let's hop in and we'll do that now. Okay, so now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. On the left-hand side, we have the rev counter, and on the right-hand side, the speedometer. At the top, in the middle, you can see the total miles on this car, which are 5,268. And at the bottom, we have the fuel gauge. Now, where that mileage is, you can change the information that's displayed there by pushing a button on the end of the indicator stalk, as you can see for various different bits of fuel economy information. Backing out to the steering wheel, on the left hand side we have stereo controls as well as voice activation for the phone. So hit that button in the middle, ask it to dial anyone in your contacts list and it can do that for you without you having to take your phone from your bag or pocket. That is of course once you've paired up your phone which is done on the central screen and stereo area just here. So uh, first of all uh, you can see with regards to the radio this car's got DAB digital radio. Uh, it's also got AM and FM as well uh, and if you want to listen to your own music we have the CD player, which you can see just at the top of that unit. We've also got a USB input, which you can see on the screen now. And once you paired your phone, you'll be able to stream music wirelessly via Bluetooth audio, as well as being able to make and receive phone calls. So the main stereo unit's just there, and the buttons I was using just a moment ago are down on the left-hand side. You've also got satellite navigation on this car as well. There's a full video showing that working on our website and on our Facebook page, which is well worth checking out. Below that, we have the air conditioning. So, fan speed is adjustable over this side. Temperature off of this dial. Hit that button to turn the air conditioning on. And then you can determine where within the car you would like the air to be distributed from there. And we also got a heated front screen as well as the usual heated rear screen. This button's for the stop and start. So this car's designed to cut out in traffic uh, when you're stationary, which will save you fuel. Hit that button to turn that system off. We then have a five speed manual gearbox. 12 volt charging socket and the USB input that I mentioned earlier. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car in person and have a test drive, please feel free to call any of our MJA sites. We'd love to hear from you soon.